<laughs> well, hate to be the one that said I told you so, but it looked like they did shock drop. Yo, what's going on with your YouTube? Jumpman Chris here. We're coming back at y'all with another vid, guys. So, all right, we gotta do some recap of the shock drop of today's military blue air Jordan fours, and also breaking news. It looked like. The date has been pushed back up, which is I'm actually pretty excited for. But let's start off with the top. Like I said in yesterday's video, I was kind of very surprised, but now it kind of makes sense why they actually did a shock drop today. I was thinking it was just way too early because the release date is going to be on May 25th, which is Memorial Day. And I was like, that is way too early for a shock drop, maybe because they had too many pairs or they had so many pairs because from what it looked like from the back end, it did. It is loaded up to 1.2 million pairs. Obviously, they didn't drop that many pairs on the shock drop. I would think it's about a couple hundred thousand pairs, maybe like 150 or something like that. It seemed like it was a good amount of Ws out there, right? So, hey, shout out to my guy, Nikki B 2313 Gave out the info yesterday. I believe we were one of the first ones to drop the video yesterday to let you guys know. And not only did they shock drop, they shock drop exactly the same time that he told me at 2 p.m. Eastern time. I don't know how many W's there were, but it seemed like there was a decent amount. But your boy, I wasn't able to get my size. I went for a size nine, nine and a half. I went on wifey's account, my account. <sighs> Took an L on the men's size, which is, hey, it's all good, man. It is what it is, can't win them all. But we did get a W for wifey. I don't know what it is, man. Every time, I swear, I can always get the wife and the kid's size. I can never get my size, though. It is what it is. So they actually dropped at 2 p.m. Eastern time. They gave us a little bit of a 15 minute notification. Like I said, I try to let you guys know ahead of time. I tried to make these videos to help you guys out as best as possible. Got in. I was pitting for a good minute, though. It was smooth getting in. I didn't have no errors or anything like that. It was a Leo drop. Even though I was pitting mad late, there were some people that were getting Ws pretty early. So the Leo, it gives you like a three minute, uh, it's like a three minute raffle or something. But like I said, it took a good minute. It, they must have had that many pairs. That's why it took so long. They must have had a lot, a lot of pairs. Hey, I got wifey size. I got, you know, the GS size. What Again, wasn't able to get a men's size, but shouts to all the people that get that got a W and if I did help you guys out make sure you guys comment down below let me know if I got you know if I did end up helping you guys out because like I said I make these videos to help you guys out as best as possible give you guys a heads up and if you guys got the W man that's all for the better man a couple things I feel like reason why they did shock drop it today I was thinking it was just way too early but now the new date it was on Memorial Day May 25th but now it's looking like they're pushing it back up on May 4th. Star Wars Day, May the 4th, be with you. The day, one day before Cinco de Mayo and all that. So, hey, I actually like this better. I am prefer it this way. I was kind of a little disappointed they're gonna drop it a little bit later because we're about three weeks away now from the release date, May 4th. So if you guys did end up taking L's because there's plenty of L's out there in W's, but for the people that did end up taking L's today, guys, do not panic, okay? Do not panic. There's going to be plenty and plenty of other chances, not just the release date on May 4th, but you know, we're going to get we're going to get some more um, early releases. I'm pretty sure we're going to get like an exclusive access. We'll get sneakers pass. We'll, Nike's going to try to dump these off as fast as possible and move all these pairs. Obviously, they cannot just release 1 million pairs all at once in one day. I mean, that sounds kind of crazy if you think about it. I mean, already moving 100,000 pairs is a lot. And even with these shoes being that hyped up, even if they made 2 million pairs, I feel like they're still going to sell out no matter what. So they're going to move them throughout the next few weeks, you know, every now and then uh, with sneaker passes and exclusive access and stuff like that. So just pay attention. There's going to be plenty and plenty more chances. Do not panic. We're three weeks away from the release date. These things are going to be everywhere and a lot of places going to have a lot of pairs. There's, you know, I, I'm believing this whole 1.7 million, if there was loaded up at 1.2 million pairs of these things on the sneakers app, that's crazy. 
that's a lot of freaking pairs. You know, you have all, all your foot stores. You have DSG. You have JD Sports, FLX, Hibbits, a lot of places. Your sneaker boutiques, wherever the case is in your area, you should be able to get a W if you put a little bit of footwork in. And I think you, everyone should be fine as long as you put in your raffles. Should be good to go. Do not just rely on sneakers. If you rely on sneakers, yes, you're probably gonna end up taking an L. I don't care how many pairs they're gonna have, because what happens, a lot of people gets on, majority of people does go on sneakers and try to hit. It's a little bit easier for most people. It's just on the apps. You know, for people to take L's, it feels kinda down, but don't worry. And for the people that did end up taking W's, a lot of people are asking me, I am planning on buying a couple pairs here and there. Um, We'll see what happens because it d does look like it's a lot of pairs. There are going to be a little bit of resale, but I have a good feeling the prices as of right now will not hold up. We're just my example is look at the reimagined breads right now. You see how those prices are? They definitely dip down, and the military blues is almost double the amount of pairs. And I feel like a lot more people rather have the reimagined breads but you know that's a different topic you know i still don't know which one i like better but just saying now, if you guys want to check out Arbit, Arbit is a free app it's a one-stop shop app where you can look at all the marketplaces you can look at StockX, gold ebay grails uh, you know other kind of places just to check the market so you don't have to keep going back and forth between apps you can just look on here it's a very easy to use and the app is free all links will be in the description below make so make sure you guys check them out we will look at the market marketplace right now I mean looks like prices dip down a decent amount again I don't want you guys to spend more money than you need to you know create that FOMO but I get it if you really want them if you absolutely have to I mean the price is kind of high right now because no one has pairs yet but like let's look at my size size 9 stock gas got, got them at low 300s or like mid 300s which is 340 gold got them at 370 Let's look at the bigger sizes, which would be size 12. They're going for basically the same price, 330 in gold got me at 350, which is kind of like, okay, usually the bigger size is the money size, I would thought. If I was you guys, if you got a W today, I would definitely try to sell out, sell them as soon as possible, because now the date has moved. So once all the pairs come in, you know all the little Timmy's are gonna dump them on the apps. They're gonna drive the price down. The undercutting will start eventually pretty soon. I would say about next week, I could definitely see prices probably dip down to about at least 300 to high 200s. And then even on release day, that's when prices might go up on release day. If uh, people, a lot of people take L's, you can see you know prices kind of go up a little bit. And then what happens the next few weeks, again, they're gonna drop back down and they're gonna be steady. And then eventually they'll go up in due time. Just like the reimagined breads. I, I don't know. I don't think these things will be worth more than reimagined breads. I feel like it'll, about, it'll probably be about the same. If not, these might be a little bit lower than the reimagined breads. Just because they made way more pairs. And I feel like the breads are a little bit more sought after colorway. But who knows? I mean, it's up to you guys. If you guys, if whatever one you guys like better. I'm just saying what I think is going to happen. Obviously, you don't have to listen to me. If you feel like these things are going to go up or go down. Do what you want to do. Yeah, man, I'm glad. I'm glad I was able to help people out. If you guys end up getting W's, congrats to all the people that got W's. And also, the, the, the date has been moved now to May 4th, which I'm really happy about. Oh, my goodness. We got, like, about three weeks away from the actual release date. I cannot wait. I would like to have a double up. I do got an early pair that I paid, woohoo, way more than I probably should have. But, hey, it's all good, man. Gotta make the content. Make sure you guys stay tuned for the channel. You guys already know. I know, I know. Everyone's already commenting. Are we going to get another 30 days straight videos? Probably. Probably. We got to do reviews. We're going to do a 30 day wear. A lot of people ask me how the fitting is right now. I don't know just yet. I will let you guys know as soon as possible. So we got to do all this, man. It's a, it's a military blues. Come on. I mean, we haven't seen a release on these things since 1989. And we haven't had that night gear in the back, so this is something really special. You know, I'm I'm hoping that everyone that really wants these things can get them, at least for retail as well. They shouldn't be too much because also remember these things retail at like 215 now. So plus tax, you're looking like almost 230. It's kind of expensive. So I don't see these things holding up prices 
but they I think they will go up in due time in the long long run it just we'll talk about that in the next few videos but hey just want to congrats everyone that got the W congratulations guys if I helped you guys out make sure you guys comment down below this is what I'm here for I want to help you guys out as best of my abilities anyway guys hey just stay tuned we got more content coming up all right anyways I will see you guys at the Kicks for Your Soul event in Orlando this Sunday. We're going down back to Orlando, man. You already know. Kicks for Your Soul. Got the championship belt. Best heat on feet. The best uh, vendor table ring. They're doing a whole bunch of crazy raffles as well. So make sure you guys pull up, man. Should be a good time. Everyone's going to be there anyways, too, man. All the homies, man. So come through. All right, anyway, guys. Just want to say, hey, I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do drop vids. And don't forget to follow me on my social media at GermanChris on IG, sometimes on Twitter, and don't forget Snapchat. I'm also on TikTok. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm German Chris. Peace.